So we're going to start a series of classes that talk about satellite design. And so the first thing is, is what are satellites even used for? Why are they even important at all? Well, there's a number of things that satellites can be used for. Uh, we have a simple example here of the NOAA Poe satellite that is in orbit around the Earth. And it can be used to, to show weather and to, to do things that you just couldn't do from the surface of the Earth. Generally speaking, there are four main categories that most satellites fall under. You have communication satellites, such that, that allow communication between two different points, or satellite TV or things like that. You have observation satellites, so this satellite is observing the, the Earth below it. You know, sometimes there'll be visible cameras and sometimes it'll be infrared or radar, but they generally fall under that category. You have navigation satellites where you know, like GPS is the most well-known, although there are others that are out there that allow you to figure out exactly where you are in the the world. You have manned satellites, International Space Station, Space Shuttle, uh, Dragon, Crude will, and the uh, Starliner will, will also be able to do that kind of stuff. There aren't a whole lot of them, but there are some out there. And there are some other purposes as well. Bottom line is, is they make things happen. You, there's something that you can do from space that's hard to do from the ground, and they figure out a way to make it happen. You, there are a couple of other ideas that have, have been tossed out there, like sample return or missions to manufacturing things, weapons that haven't really had a whole lot of stuff that's been done. But they make something happen that can't happen from Earth. And that is why we have satellites, and they really are used in many ways that most of us don't even realize these days. So throughout this course, then I'm going to continue to teach about the basics of satellites. What are each of the components on the, a typical satellite? How would you go about building them? And, and so on. But bottom line, they make stuff happen in space. Thank you much for joining me on this journey, and we will see you next time. Keep on tracking.